In this video, I am going to discuss about basics of vertebral anatomy. The anterior portion of the spine consists of cylindrical vertebral body. The posterior portion of the spine consists of vertebral arches and seven processes. Each vertebral arch consists of paired pedicles anteriorly and paired laminae posteriorly. The vertebral arch gives rise to seven processes that is two transverse processes laterally, one spinous process posteriorly, two superior articular facets and two inferior facets which cannot be shown in this diagram. The spinal canal is occupied by the spinal cord with its outer cortex and inner medulla with the central canal. The ventral or motor root arises from the ventral horn and the dorsal or sensory root arises from the dorsal horn and both the roots unite in the vertebral foramen and form a respective spinal root. The vertebral bodies are separated by intervertebral discs and held together by anterior and posterior longitudinal ligaments. The intervertebral discs are composed of a central gelatinous nucleus pulposus surrounded by a tough cartilaginous ring that is annulus fibrosus. The spinous processes are located posteriorly. The superior articular facets articulate with inferior articular facets to form the facet joints. The superior vertebral notch and inferior vertebral notch forms the intervertebral foramen through which respective spinal root passes out. 